Today we will learn how to design this worm and wheel, how to assemble them and connect them with gearing mechanism and servo motors to have this wonderful animation. And one thing more, we will do all this by using PTC Creo Parametric. अगर आप चाहते हैं कि मैं वीडियोस उर्दू में भी बनाऊं, तो कमेंट सेक्शन में मुझे बताएं। Assalamu alaikum. This is Huzaifa Saleh and welcome back to my channel. Before we start today's video, let me tell you something that would help you to understand what I am doing during the video. This is my left click and this is my right click. Start with opening a new part, name it guide. Select a plane and hit the sketch button. Sketch view will make easier to see your selected plane. Draw a circle of 20 diameter and extrude it 20. But extrude must be symmetric to both sides of plane. Now this time I would make sketch just directly going to the extrude command and selecting the plane. Select the plane which is parallel to the cylinder's axis. Similarly, make a circle of 20 diameter, extrude it symmetrically 80. The guide is complete. Save it and move to the next part. Next is worm gear. Make a circle of radius 15.5 and diameter would be 31. Make another circle with the same center of 20 diameter. Extrude it 80 and of course, smith it to the both sides of plane. To make gearing on the cylinder, go to the helical sweep. In references, Define helix sweep profile. Creo will ask for plane, select one which is parallel to the cylinder axis. Go to sketch. I am just putting references to the cylinder. Actually, in this section, I have to tell Creo how long the helix would be. So just draw a line of the same length of helix you want. 
remember this dimension with axis it is 18 this dimension is pitch diameter now tell Creo the axis around you want to rotate your helix define pitch in our case it is 2 pi by clicking this pencil icon it will take you to sketch now you have to draw the profile of helix in our case it is profile of gear teeth Helical sweep is done. This icon will make helix by left hand rule and the other will make it by right hand rule. Now we don't want gearing on ends of cylinder. To remove it, we are using revolve command. By selecting plane, you will find yourself in sketch. I'm just making references for accurate drawing. Give the dimension 15 from end of the cylinder. Now select the axis around your drawn sketch must revolve. Click on material remove icon. And yes, we are good to move to our next and last part. Save the worm and move on.
new part is wheel. Make a hold disk of 2 into 61 minus 2.25. And center hole is of 20 diameter. Extrude it by 20. One tooth is done. Just round its corner. The corner dimension is 0.5. Now we want this tooth 
all around the disk. For this, there are two commands to be patterned. But when we select both commands, the pattern command is disabled. So before pattern, just make them one command by grouping them. Apply pattern, which is access pattern. Number of teeth are 61. And here comes the end of this video, which is part 1 of Worm Wheel Mechanism. If you want to make my videos in Urdu, please tell me in the comment section. So see you in the next video. Allah Hafiz.